Taishan pronoun of Ben Miller, author, she actor, character is quite a multi she akuma in Kurdish, dar she has the cargo of the same cool. Hello, Mr. Ben, how are you doing? I'm doing really, it's lovely to see you again, we're old friends. Yes, it's absolutely lovely to see you as well, especially in person. Thank you. I have to say, there's more of you than there was last time I spoke to you. You're much taller. You're much taller. <laughs> I get that a lot. I get that a lot. <laughs> so, so we heard that um, you were actually in Bucharest for a while now. Yeah. Um, how did you get here, and for what occasion? So I came yesterday. I'm very excited that my books are published in Romania and that they're. Uh, they're so popular, so I really wanted to come and meet some of my readers and also to experience Bucharest and to experience Romania. It's my first visit here, so it's quite a short visit. I arrived yesterday, I leave tomorrow, but um, I really want to come back and it's been such a positive experience. And I've been to some great schools and we've done some great events and met some amazing people. So I'm really, really, really happy to be here. Yes, um, I heard that you are actually um, collaborating with Cambridge and doing lessons there for... That's Cambridge. right, tomorrow I'll be at um, Cambridge School. I was at two schools this morning that got quite similar names. Someone might have to help me with the names. There was the British, British School, the British School, and the School British, British or something. There was like BSB and yeah. BSB. That's right. Yeah. There were two RBSB and BSB. Yeah. And, uh, we also did some events yesterday at the British Council, which was really fun. So we met um, some young readers that came to the British Council. Then we also did an event later on for slightly older readers who were more less interested in these books and more interested in the movies and the actors. Yes, actors. Yeah. Yeah, that is absolutely lovely. Speaking of your books, however, do you actually plan on um, any more releases in this year or in the future? Thank you for asking. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do, I do. Um, so I have a new book. Um, that's just out in uh, English that hopefully will be coming out in Romanian soon. It's this one, Once Upon a Legend. It's a story. I was very, very excited to see this here because I've not seen the paperback version in the UK. Only here in Romania do you have the paperback version, which is marvellous. Uh, so this is a story. It's another magical adventure story, uh, this time about a boy who... See this cover here? This is actually uh, the face of a giant. These rocks are the face of a giant. And the story is about a boy who wakes a sleeping giant and they have an adventure together. That um, sounds absolutely lovely. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, so I'm very excited for that. I'm very excited for, um, I hope, so at the moment I just have two book, two of my books in Romanian. I have The Night I Met Father Christmas and The Boy Who Made the World Disappear. But I'm really hoping that um, soon maybe we can bring out a fairy tale. And, yeah, I'm hoping to meet, that's another reason for coming here is I'm hoping to meet my publishers and uh, talk about uh, future plans. And um, speaking of which, even if you spent so little time in Eucharist and in Romania, yeah. have you had any experiences that you truly are fond of? Yeah, yeah. it's been amazing. The people, uh, really, for me, any place I go, it's about the people. I mean, and also it's, it's wonderful to have a city that progresses such a mix of architecture. You have these, for, to me it feels very like a, 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 a real mix of East and Western Europe. So you have these, some bits feel very like Paris or feel like Vienna. Other bits, you know, feel, feel more Eastern to me. And you have the amazing communist architecture. And I love the view from my room. I have a, I, I look out of the, um, I'm staying at the Grand Hotel and I look out of the window and all the buildings are white. It's beautiful. It's like an amazing cityscape that I've never seen anywhere. So I love, I love the architecture. We had a fantastic uh, meal last night at some uh, really uh, unique Romanian dishes, but mainly for me it's the people. The Romanian people, first of all, speak unbelievably good English. It's really quite incredible to come here and you find... Um, you find that, uh, that 
people speak English so fluently, which is incredibly impressive, but it's their warmth, it's their inclusiveness, it's their friendliness, and it's the uh, joie de vivre that I really love. <laughs> and that, that is pretty much what I we're, think. We're, we're concluding the yeah. interview for now. We'll yes, do some more interviews, maybe. Yeah, with the people, with the yeah. audience. Do you have any questions, everybody? Do you want to No. No. Um, I'll ask a question. Has anybody read uh, any of my books? Has anything you read from my books? Yes. Uh, have you? Which one have you read? Uh, the one with the dog. The dog. How I became a dog called Midnight. So you yes. must have read that in English, right? Yes. Yeah. Well, that's very, very impressive. And. Um, what did you, um, so this is a story, How I Became a Dog Called Midnight, it's not one of the ones here, this is about a boy that swaps bodies with a dog, and then the two of them, uh, him and his friend, uh, a girl, Coco, they solve a crime together, and he uses his superpowers as a dog to help solve the crime. Now I heard, is this true, that dogs are allowed in this bookshop? That's what I heard. Yes. So if any, I really love dogs. So if anybody's a boxing dog, I really love to meet them. <laughs> Has anybody else read uh, any of the books? Chris, you don't count. No, I know, but I have. <laughs> you're, you're in year nine now. I don't yeah, know. I didn't count. Years. <laughs> Anna, you would. Re you yeah. Read some. We, we talked about that this morning, yeah. didn't we? Um, anyone else? Anyone want to ask a question? Hi. <laughs> Hi, I was just here. We look like a, a policeman. Yeah. <laughs> I am.